how you love the South Side dinosaurs and all those guys. Like Victor the Velociraptor. I know you love all the pterosaurs. I know you love Ally the Allosaurus. And all the other strange and wonderful dinosaurs on this island. Like the wonderful Diplodocus. But we are taking a trip to the west side of the island. And, and on the east side, I don't know if you can see it, but there is a turtle. Narcolon, he went under, um, in that, this lake, right now it's high tide in the lake, and so it's a nice little lake for dinosaurs to come and drink. This is from a major, this lake comes from a major river that goes through the whole island, and this is Timmy, the same thing from his, from episode 7, and he's traveled up the, up the river. Timmy was followed too by the same Dinosuchus. There also are some other um, creatures from the west side. There's Archelon. It is uh, breeding season. And it is coming up the shore to lay its eggs. The Spinosaurus is fishing. It is unaware that there's a steel kit that got stuck on the sh near the shore in shallow water. Dinosaurs are bathing and drinking from the lake. They are trying to keep their distance from the Spinosaurus because it's the same herd of Stegosaurus and the same Spinosaurus. Baryonyx is doing the same exact thing that the Spinosaurus is doing. Fishing. But he is out of luck. The Dinosuchus has gotten closer to the Tantrum is Timmy. The the uh, dim, dim, the uh, ah, Dinosuchus is has um, crept closer and is using his master to uh, Timmy. He's used his master plan of this of camouflage so that he can sneak up on Timmy and kill him. Timmy has gone closer to the Dinosuchus, looking for some food, and that's when. The dinosaur gets attacked. And then Timmy gets away. Meanwhile, in the in the um in the southern woods, these the Violet and Straightback have apparently gone another direction, made another U turn, and have gone to the east side. And right now, they're stalking a baby Thorosaurus. Even as a youngster. The Thorosaurus are very deadly because they, even from a youngster, they have huge claws. Uh, this is a very dangerous thing to do. And and Victor, I mean Violet and Stripeback are very very hungry, so they are weak. They haven't eaten in like a month. Violet has now gotten closer to the youngster, but she has made a very bad mistake. <laughs> Violet has fallen down this steep, this not so steep hill. Mother has made her move, and she is very, 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 very close to the youngster. Straight back, and he tries to make an escape, and actually, he succeeds. Well, looks like he does. Noise <laughs> has alerted the Thorosaurus, but it's too late. Straightback and Violet have already made it safely away from the Thorosaurus. <laughs> Up the hill, two Pachycephalosaurus are battling each other. The the 
bigger and older back on Cephalosaur? One. It was a territorial battle. This Diplodocus is search is searching for food. He's not found any at this um root of this prehistoric tree that is very, 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 very tall. But anyway, he's foraging. He hits for the really tall grass, but he is being stalked by a Spinosaurus. <coughs> the Diplodocus runs and falls off these gigantic roots. Diplodocus is now dead. And there is the dead body of this poor Diplodocus. And the Spinosaurus carefully descends down the hill. Will he make it? Or will he die? This is a very steep slope. Maybe he'll make it, maybe he won't. To be continued.